You might be wondering, now that I am here, what type of classes should I be taking? Well, at CSC, academic programs are divided into two categories, university studies and occupational programs. University studies programs are developed specifically for students pursuing a baccalaureate degree and plan on transferring to a four-year college or university. Occupational programs are specialized programs which emphasize specific job-oriented skills and are not intended for college or university transfer credit. For more information on academic programs at CSE, pick up our catalog on campus or visit the CSE website for more details. Now that you know what program options there are at CSE, how do you pick which one to pursue? To figure out your best option, you should schedule an appointment with your counselor to decide on a degree plan and establish your educational goals. Once you decide what program to pursue, how do you know what courses to enroll in? You can refer to the CSE College Catalog before meeting with your counselor to make course selections. The catalog will show you which courses are needed to complete your degree or certificate. Hard copies of the catalog are available in the admissions office or you can view it online at the CSC website. If you decide to add a class after already registering, you can do so during the first week of the term with written permission from the instructor of the class you want to add. To withdraw from a class, you must notify the Records and Registration Office in writing by either completing a student class schedule change form or by sending a letter. In some instances, instructors may withdraw students from classes at midterm for non-attendance. The college administration may also withdraw students from classes for emergency or disciplinary reasons after due process. It is important to note that you will not get automatically dropped from a class just because you don't attend class. If you register for a class, you must officially withdraw by notifying your counselor even if tuition and fees have not been paid. A temporary grade of I may be given to students in cases where they have been unable to complete coursework due to circumstances beyond their control. An incomplete grade must be removed by midterm of the following semester or the grade will become an F. If you need academic advisement at any time, contact the Records and Registration Office for help or the counselor you are assigned with when you register. If you ever have questions about whether you will fulfill your degree or certificate requirements for graduation, see your counselor.